Give us your speaker. Now, uh, known, uh, a well-known person named Noam Chomsky said that a language is power and that if we, know it, if we start studying languages that our brain cells start activating, it is actually very efficient for our brain. And a lot of people tell us it is a no well-known saying that language is power. Now, to the motion, this house would require all Korean students to learn a third language. It is the job of the Prime Minister to provide the parameters of the debate. For this house, we define this house as South Korea because this, this motion concerns Korean students and no students from other nations. And we define require as enforced as necessary. And we define Korean students as students ranging from those in elementary school to university. And we define a third language as any language of choice. I, as a prime minister, will talk about why we must implement this policy and how we will in implement this policy as our deputy prime minister will explain to the house uh, the results and the be possible benefits that can come out of this policy being enacted. First of all, I will talk about why we must implement this policy. Why should we implement this policy, uh, okay. Mr. Speaker? First, we have to realize that Korea is disadvantageous. Although a large percentage of Korean citizens know how to speak English, and they know they are very bilingual and that they are efficient at two languages, Korean and English, they, sh they all share a disadvantage Disadvantage in that other nations with bilingual citizens have, such as, Fran such as France, Spain, or the United Kingdom, they speak English and another language that is well used in the United Nations and many international or organizational meetings and such. For example, people from France speak English and French, and French is a well-used language in the United Nations. People from Spain use English and Spanish. People from the United Kingdom are able to speak French and, uh, French and English very fluently. However, we need to realize that people in Korea know how to speak Korean and English, and we need to know that Korean is not a well-known language, as in it is not useful in the international arena. We need, to, we need to realize that there is a heavy demand for, uh, for Korean uh, kids to be able to speak other languages besides English. There is a heavy demand. And because other nations are able to engage in foreign relations in other languages besides English, we have to realize that this is in need and it will be beneficial. Beneficial. No, thank you. No, thank you, ma'am. Also, we have to realize that the world is restless and that world is always prone to change. Because the United Nations, uh, the United States of America and the United Kingdom is high, in high power right now, English has become a universal language. However, we have to realize that the world is highly prone to change. It, it can be a matter of seconds or a matter of years be, uh, when China or India or other nations such as France, Germany becomes into power. We have to be able to change at a moment's notice. In that, we have to be able to learn a third language. We cannot be controlled by a single language called English. We have to be able to be um, uh, we, have, we have to be able to change at a moment's notice and not be affected by English to an extent where people will be highly, uh, will have high detrimental uh, effects. And also, in Korea, there is a high lack of diversity in that many people have choose only three fields, e either a doctor, a lawyer, or some kind of being a professor. There, are, there is a high lack of diversity in Korean sorry, talent. Sorry. We realize that a lot of people, as I've stated, a lot of people in Korea speak English. However, they, there are not a lot of people who speak Russian or fluent Chinese or Spanish, French. We need to realize that there, need, there needs to be more variety and that it will bring a lot of more benefits, as we will mention later, and that there will be less fees for translation and a greater supply of people who will be able to speak diverse languages and that it will increase foreign relations and that we will have a lot more in common with other nations besides the United Kingdom or America. And to talk about the practicality of how, how we will implement this policy. We have mentioned that the third language we're talking about will be any language that, of choice. And because Korea is a highly competitive nation and it is a newly industrial, industrialized nation, it will be always willing to keep up with other nations. We know that many other, because if, look, if our government is willing to implement this policy and is willing to encourage That's diversity, um, and this policy will start from Seoul and uh, 
uh, divulge into the rest of Korea. We believe that the Korean Ministry of Education and the Korean government will be willing to influence, uh, advocate this policy and to implement it to the rest of Korea. We believe that if ten, more than 10 students want to learn a language, they can sign up to the school and they can uh, sign up to the government recruiting uh, the teachers to teach other languages. Thank you. That is why we just closed this motion.